Hey there, boys and girls. So, figured I'd show you what I'm planning on doing here. My manifold goes from like, I don't know if that's an inch and five eighths, I think it's inch and five eighths tubing. It necks down a little bit to where the stock connector would be here for a dual port. And these manifolds were pretty big here, and they are decent on the bottom, but where it bends here, I remember it looked like it had a pinch in it. And they look really smooth from the outside, but I don't think they are all the way. And trying to port that crazy curve, so it only not only does it come down and then back and down and curve in, that would be really hard to get a cutter around in there. I may still try and port these, but I'm thinking I'm going to build my own manifolds. What I'm going to do is come straight out with a pipe up and then like a big barrel pipe to make a plenum and cap both ends of that and then come out of the side of that plenum over here with like an inch and five eighths whatever the size this is so let's see I'll show you some pipe I got I had this laying around it's a header tube and it's going to take a little bit of trimming just to make it slide in in the stock gasket area but it fits in there right on it and I'll have to sand it down you know I think I'll have to clearance it just a little bit to get it to have a really good snug fit in there. But I'll probably do that up to here and then put a, another pipe going this way and cap both ends of that. And then wherever I got to turn it, I'll come from this side and put another pipe into it. So it's going to be a little funky looking, but I've seen other people do it and it seemed to work. One guy did it on a single port and other people do it on dual ports and make a plenum out of there and I think the extra volume of plenum will help me too so that's coming in the future we just gotta get get to work right now I have no garage space my garage is all taken up with house stuff right now so no much and kid party stuff so there's no um, work <laughs> I can barely even walk in here there's no working on it right this moment but I will try and get that done I don't want to just jump to a dual port just yet. I want to kind of max out this combo, or at least what I think it will be. After the manifolds, I may try a four barrel and kind of think about it. I believe my brother has a 390 four barrel, and uh, I think the drivability is going to go down the window with it, but I'd like to see if it does an ET difference on it, if it does build more power. So that's another thing to try. and. Uh, and then after that, you know, of course, weld up the hole in the exhaust. i got to do that, too. After I do all those things, and it's still not going the number I want, I have another choice of either pulling the heads off, doing some more work to them, or just go to dual port, and I'll, I'll kind of figure out what I want to do there. But right now, I want to see what I can get out of the uh, little single port here. New Year's goals to go to the 1350s with it. So I think it's possible. Um probably another 20 horsepower in all reality to go to go about a second faster maybe a little more but um you know it is what it is so i'll see you guys later let's just give you a little update i do have some plans and we're going to get this stuff worked on as soon as i can get some space to move around and work on it